Peter L. Warwick is an American former college and professional football player who was a wide receiver in National Football League for six seasons. He played college football at Florida State University and was recognized a consensus All-American twice. He was drafted by the Cincinnati Bengals fourth overall in the 2000 NFL Draft and has played professionally for the Bengals and Seattle Seahawks of the NFL and the Bloomington Extreme of the Indoor Football League. Early years Born in Bradenton, Florida, Warwick attended Southeast High School in Bradenton, where he played high school football, basketball and ran track. He played wide receiver as a junior and caught 36 passes for over 600 yards and 9 touchdowns. He played quarterback as a senior, rushing for 673 yards and 13 touchdowns, while completing 49 of 96 passes for 1,109 yards and 13 scores. He also returned four punts for touchdowns during his junior and senior seasons. He served as team captain and led Southeast High in Bradenton to two consecutive state titles. He was USA Today Honorable Mention, Parade All-American and First Team Class 5A All-State. In basketball, he was named the Player of the Year in the state of Florida. In track and field, Warwick was one of the state's top performers in the sprinting and jumping events. He was the state runner-up in the long jump as a junior at 7.16 meters. He won two state 6A titles in the long jump as a senior, recording a personal best jump of 7.25 meters. He ran a career best time of 10.59 seconds in the 100 meters at the regional 5A state meet. He was chosen all-area first team in the 100 meters and long jump events. Recruiting considered by some to be the nation's best wide receiver, Warwick was, according to National Recruiting Advisor, the no. 1 wide receiver and no. 7 player in the nation. He chose to attend FSU over scholarship offers from every major program. College career. Warwick received an athletic scholarship to attend Florida State University and played for coach Bobby Bowden's Florida State Seminoles football team from 1996 to 1999. He primarily played wide receiver and returned punts, leading Florida State to BCS National Championship game appearances in 1998 and 1999. During the 1999 season, Florida State was the first team in college football history to rank first in the polls throughout the season and end with the number one ranking in the country. Warwick was recognized as a consensus first team All-American and the MVP of the 2000 Sugar Bowl with over 160 yards receiving and three touchdowns including a 59-yard punt return. Warwick graduated from Florida State with a Bachelor of Science degree in Political Science in 1999. College stats and awards 207 career receptions 32 touchdown receptions most in FSU history 937 career return yards averaged 127.3 all-purpose as a senior awards 1998. NCAA Consensus All-American Associated Press, First Team All-American Walter Camp Football Foundation, First Team All-American The Sporting News, First Team All-American Football Digest, First Team All-American Football News, Second Team All-American First Team All-ACC 1999. NCAA Consensus All-American Walter Camp Football Foundation, First Team All-American Football Writers Association of America, First Team, All-American Football News, First Team All-American The Sporting News, First Team All-American Associated Press, First Team All-American, All-American Foundation, First Team All-American American Football Coaches Association, First Team All-American First Team All-ACC Dillard's Department Store Incident on September 29, 1999, during Warwick's senior season at Florida State. 
Warwick and teammate Lava Anu's Coles went to Dillard's in the Tallahassee Mall and bought $412.38 worth of clothing for $21.40, a discount so large that it is considered shoplifting under Florida law. An off-duty officer saw what happened through a surveillance camera. Warwick, Coles and the clerk, Rachel Myrtle, were arrested for grand theft. On October 22, Warwick pleaded guilty to misdemeanor petty theft in connection with the department store scam. At that year's rivalry game between Florida Gators and Florida State, Gators fans brought Dillard's bags to Florida Field in order to mock Warwick. Florida State won the game 30-23 at the time of his arrest. Warwick was widely considered the frontrunner for the Heisman Trophy with 36 catches for 508 yards and four touchdowns on the season. Following the arrest, Florida State suspended Warwick for two games since school rules prevented him from playing while charges were pending. The two-game suspension, along with the negative publicity he received in the national media, ended any chance for Warwick to be awarded the Heisman Trophy. At season's end, Warwick was not invited to the award presentation at the Downtown Athletic Club and finished sixth in the overall voting professional career. Cincinnati Bengals In his first three seasons with the Bengals, Warwick never gained more than 667 receiving yards. In 2003, Warwick caught a career-high 79 passes for 819 yards and seven touchdowns, while gaining 143 rushing yards and adding another 273 yards and a touchdown returning punts. Warwick missed most of the 2004 season with an injury, and receiver T.J. Hushmanzada, a seventh-round pick in the 2001 draft, replaced him at the number two receiver spot and ended up having the best season of his career. Warwick was released from the Bengals before the start of the 2005 season. Seattle Seahawks Warwick subsequently signed with the Seattle Seahawks. In his first season with Seattle, Warwick was used infrequently in the starting lineup. He finished the season with 11 catches for 180 yards, one carry for 5 yards, and 6 punt returns for 29 yards. However, for most of the postseason and in Super Bowl XL, Warwick served as the team's starting punt returner. His 12-yard punt return in the first quarter of the Super Bowl helped set up the Seahawks' first points of the game. Later he had a 34-yard return, but it was negated by a penalty. He finished Super Bowl XL with four punt returns for 27 yards. On September 2, 2006, Warwick was cut from the Seahawks following the preseason. The New York Giants worked out Warwick on November 13, 2006. He worked out with the Bengals as well in late 2006, but they opted to pass on him. Las Vegas Gladiators On January 4, 2007, the Las Vegas Gladiators of the Arena Football League signed Warwick. Per club policy, terms of the deals were not disclosed. Warwick was a no-show after the AFL's Week 1, and was placed on the refuse to report list by the team. Warwick did not work out with any teams in 2007, though Miami, Carolina, Jacksonville, and the New York Jets reportedly all contacted Warwick's agent about potential workouts. Montreal Alouettes In May 2008, Warwick was signed by the Montreal Alouettes of the Canadian Football League. He was released on June 3. Bloomington Extreme In 2009, Warwick was signed by the Bloomington Extreme of the Indoor Football League. He only played for one season. Cincinnati Commandos In 2011, under the guidance of Hollywood producer and agent Nick Visga, Warwick signed with the Cincinnati Commandos of the Continental Indoor Football League. Visga is credited with getting Warwick the contract with the Commandos and Warwick has gone on record stating his gratitude to Visga for this opportunity. He never played in a single game for the Commandos. Warwick though did become a spokesman for Cincinnati-based Cologne brand, Bisher. The sponsorship terminated in 2013.